Hmm. I thought it was going to break for a second. <laughs> Why do you have to get cough drops all over my couch and floor and table? It's funnier this way. <laughs> easy, e easy. <laughs> okay. Easy to access, maybe. <laughs> they're just... Because I, I still have, like, two from that bag of um, the honey lemon ones. Yeah. I still have, like, two sitting on the, the counter over there. Convenient. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> you mean from when I, I threw the bag in the air? Oh, yeah. And they and just, like, scattered, spilled everywhere? Scattered hither and yon. Yeah. I just... <laughs> it's fine. The cats will play with them. They'll try to get into them. There you go. Hello, hello, everybody. Hello. What's up? Have Howdy. You, have you liked going? hanging around with Alex? Alexios is pretty cool. I do is like he him. Pretty good? Yeah, okay. I don't. I don't mind him very much. I don't mind him at all. He's okay. he's, a, he's a cute little boy. He's not my favorite. He's a cute little guy. He's mm. a cute fella, you know. But he seems like a cool friend. <laughs> but who knows? He could he could be a backstabbing, conniving little bitch boy. So we'll Would see. Would you fuck him? Mm, maybe. <laughs> he's small enough. I could probably top him, sure. Oh, you don't think he would top you? No, probably not. Uh... But then again, we've only seen the part of his personality that's just him being a servant. You know, <laughs> who knows what he's like back on his home world when he's like independent. I, I think he's so conniving that he like convinces people to bottom for him. Oh, but is he conniving? Is he? Well, he's a cat. That is speciesist, Josh. Yes, it is. <laughs> That's very speciesist. <laughs> well, you've seen, like, some of his dialogue right from the start's kind of sus, I think. I suppose or, like, so. right away, he's like, oh, you're lying about your intelligence. Like, like he definitely... How quickly he caught on to that. He catches on. He's he's intelligent. Like, that. That there is no doubt about that. Yeah, and I need to watch Ranking of Kings. Oh, it's Osama so good. Ranking is like, so good. No, the show is gorgeous. Oh, 10, 10, 10, 10. It's very good. I already picked up on the wholesomeness when I was like, seeing screenshots and trailers. Just, it's kind of what God. you want. Yeah, I'm trying his best. He's doing his bestest. And then just animators flexing on every episode. Oh, it's facts. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> we'll see, though. We'll see, about, uh, we'll see about Alex. Yeah. You know. Uh, for the next um, hour, we move from pillar to pillar, cleaning up the unwanted weeds. <clears throat> I'm way more vigilant now at checking every pillar for spiders before we start. Do you want spiders to be that big? I really don't. But, I mean, they exist. We just, you know, that they'd be on Australia, which is yeah. why, as much as I would kind of like to go to Australia, I no, probably never will. No, I'll go to New Zealand. I don't think New Zealand has any of the killer stuff that Australia does. Or at least most of them don't. They're a separate island, you know? They got different ecosystems and stuff. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I took out my phone as if I was going to, like, look it up. I was wondering, were you, were you looking I up had, something? No, I was just going to set it to the side. Okay. <laughs> okay. Nice, nice light gaslighting there. It's fine. Yeah, I've never gaslit ne in oh, my life. Oh, never. No. Never, ever, ever. No. I do girl boss sometimes, though. <laughs> we, all, we all could use a little bit of girl bossing in our life, you know? It's it's, fine. it's It's okay to... We don't need any gatekeeping, though. But you know. Oh no, we gatekeep. Yeah, I, I wasn't. I wasn't gonna say it, <laughs> but I know gate. <laughs> you truly are the gaslight gatekeep girl boss, Josh. <laughs> Don't know how to tell you this. You check all three boxes. That means I'm a top, right? <laughs> not 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 according to popular opinion. Sorry. Don't I love it. Like Jenna's gaslight keep, keep girl boss, and she's a top. I don't know if Jenna's so much gaslight. She's definitely gatekeeping girl boss. There could be. Leo is way more gaslighty than she there is. Could be power bottoms. No, Chase is a power bottom. So yeah, Chase is a power bottom. Josh isn't a power bottom though, nor is he a top. Sorry. <laughs> um. Yeah, y'all heard it right here. Y'all heard it here, folks. <laughs> oh, this bless is, this it. Is terrible. <laughs> bless it. Here we go. Fuck. <laughs> oh, 
And uh, I can't pull up a poll about it because they will all just click bottom. <laughs> yeah, this is fact. This is fact. I could do it. I could make a poll and then post it, but then, you know, it wouldn't be nearly as seen. No. I could just make it for the patrons only. If you want to vote on if Josh is a bratty bottom or they not. They would all just say that, <laughs> even if they don't believe it. But they all believe oh, it. Oh, fuck you. It's true. <laughs> Because they do. <laughs> but no, I, I think that Jenna does some gaslighting. I, 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 yeah, I mean, she's not, she's not, she, she isn't pure. She is not. Like, she even talks about how, like, oh, well, I guess you didn't read some of the, the side stories. Like, I don't know. She, like, convinces Chase of things. Like, even in Jenna's route, where it's like, nah, it's Leo's fault. True. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. And you're just like. Jenna. She does. She is all three. <laughs> Leo is like just a heavy gaslighter. Though. Yeah, he's just gaslighting. That's fine. That's gonna be hot. He's not really girl boss material, and I don't really think he gatekeeps because he's like, hey, I want everyone to be included, except unless unless it involves Chase, in which case everyone fuck off except for Chase. So I guess he's gatekeeping Chase. Good. So I mean, there's that. But no, he does. He doesn't have girl boss though. <laughs> No, Flynn has girl boss. <laughs> Flynn is a girl boss. Flynn is a girl boss. Uh, is he a gatekeeper? No. No? No, because Flynn's probably like the nicest member of the cast, unironically. Yeah, I suppose so. Like he's an ass, but he's like probably like right. the nicest person of them. He's pretty open to everyone. Yeah. TJ's a gaslighter. He, he won't judge yeah, me yes. severely. TJ's the... Open to I like to think that, like, TJ's mm-hmm. the ultimate villain of Echo. TJ gaslights everyone, even himself. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it might have something to do with locking away deep, deep trauma, but he... No one is safe from his gaslighting, even TJ. Trust no one, not even yourself. Oh my god. All I can think about is... The dude with the gun. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, him with the of of himself. It's very good. (laughs) And another one is just like, trust no one, not even no one. It's like, no one's there but the gun And I don't know what that's from, the trust no one, not even yourself. But like, it's it's just that that old meme. It's just really good. (laughs) Um, Carl is is a, a, was it? Mansplain. it's it's mansplain something male wife. Um, mansplain manspread male wife. Are that's, you sure that's not kudzu? He does have a waterbed. <laughs> <laughs> that's very mans like someone who has a who has a waterbed will mansplain to you as well as manspread, and he is basically just a male wife. Yeah, he is. I uh, would get. Yeah. <laughs> Aren't they like expensive too? Uh, unnecessarily, because you have to pay to heat them too. They usually come with heaters yeah, separate. Yeah, because like because it's, it's cold. It's if you don't water. heat it, it's water. It's gonna get cold. I know. I know. Water, so of course you're gonna get cold. See, it's like you know. It's the worst. If I met Kudzu out at a bar and he was like schmoozing me and smooth talking me and convinced me to come back to his house with him, you know, if we're like barging in the door making out, as soon as I see that bed, I'm like. We're either going to my place or I'm fucking leaving. <laughs> and just shut it down right there. That is what would happen. Sorry, bro. Or just do it on the floor. Yeah. No, I, like, don't no, I touch it. No. I I couldn't be in I couldn't be in that in the house with it. I would have to leave. Well just go on the ground outside. You know, maybe. But just that water bed is no. Mm mm. No, sir. Sorry, I can't do it. I think the whole thing about it is like literally like a lot of people sex which is wild sure but that thing it's such a gimmick sleep on it it just seems so uncomfortable mm. you sink into it there's no support really oh my god I can't. unless you like to sink like in and be held there oh like an air mattress mm-hmm. which i also don't like air mattresses no but i can take that over a water bed. imagine no imagine like a portable water bed a la an air mattress <laughs> Like like a twin like a twin water bed that you take to someone's house for a sleepover. You have to take it outside to the hose to fill it up and then drag it inside. I 
<laughs> you hook it up to a water pump. Yeah. But you just cook it up to, like the bathtub. Yeah. Or or like you're like, man, I can't go all the way out. So you don't have a, like a hose spigot outside. What the hell is wrong with your house? You have to stand in the sink and fill it up, like in the kitchen and hold the nozzle up to the sink and fill it up. What if you just get an air mattress and fill it up with water? Oh, that's next level. Yes. <laughs> We solved the puzzle, guys. <sighs> Luckily, we don't come across anymore. <laughs> and after a while, we finally sit on a bench under under some trees, and calm floats out of a uh, calm floats out a few pl- pl- platters mm-hmm. platters of tiny pastries that remind me of quiches. That's quiche, plural of that's quiches, plural of quiche. That's how you spell that. I've never seen the word quiche before. I know, like I've heard the word. But yeah, I've never you know what you know what a quiche is. That's how it's spelled. I'm like, where's the K? <laughs> no, it's Q. <laughs> Highly underutilized, but makes the same sound. The fuck is English? Why are letters bad? Like, like, if, like, imagine if Queen was spelled K W E E N instead of Q U E E N. You know how ugly that would look. <laughs> wait, wait. Oh no, what is he doing? I want to spell it out. It's It doesn't look good. <laughs> okay, okay, so. Queen. Like that? No, K, like imagine if Queen was K W E E N. Imagine that. Just imagine, K, visualize. Wait, you said K W. K W. Because traditionally, Qu, like, qu, 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 like the like was sound. Yeah, it's really <laughs> ugly looking, and I don't like it. Oh my god. I have the chaotic energy of getting out the uh, cover kit. Cutting that out. Cutting that out. Oh god. He just he just tweeted it. Just that word. Oh my god. So two weeks from now. When when people catch up, they're gonna be like, what the fuck, man? And then they're like, oh, it all makes sense now. I have to go retweet it real quick. Hang on. It's very important. Very important. Okay. <laughs> oh, those are followed by glasses of cold green uh, vegetable vegetable tasting drinks. Okay, it's delicious. Like cucumber water. Okay. Cucumber water is really good. So, can I ask where you're from? Very far away, even further than your home. What? what? Okay, fine. You don't know where it is. Wait. Also, he. It could be closer then, because he doesn't know where. How Earth. far? Yeah, oh, they yeah. don't know about Earth yet. I guess so. That's, so. that's fair. Mm-hmm. But he knows okay. he had to use the stretch drive, right? Yeah, like, but that could be like that could be anywhere, right? I guess so. Yeah, fair enough. <clears throat> what brought you here? The cat sighs and pauses with a pastry halfway in, into his mouth. It's a bit complicated, but I was here as a uh, sort of ambassador. I arrived just as. Just as the stretch dive uh, depleted, depletion occurred. What was that? Uh, Alex shrugs. Well, for whatever reason, the ra- ra- Romanus mm-hmm. uh, stopped us uh, supplying the wolves this, with stretch drive power uh, when the Emperor died. Uh, they're starborn. Yeah, starbound. Bound. Uh, mm-hmm. Right now. Uh, so they can't uh, shuttle me back to my planet. The situation between the wolves and their parents is worrying, and we won't know how long the wolves will be without the stretch. So my people sent their own ship to retrieve everyone on Adastra, but I, um, missed it. Oof. That sucks. (laughs) Missed it? So, the wolves... So the wolves don't have access to the stretch right now, but the other elevated species do right now? You know, I kind of don't know. Like, like, is this like a whole universal thing that's happening? Like, because I mean, you know, if he needs to go home, his people could just like that, yeah. send one if if they have access to the stretch, right? But I don't, I don't fucking know, man. Mm-hmm. No, I didn't write it. Right? Alex frowns, looking embarrassed again. Well, I slept in and missed the departure. You fool! <laughs> wow, really? <laughs> I mean, it happens to the best of us, no? I don't know. I've never slept in in my life. Uh, I guess. Uh, why don't... I don't know about that. <laughs> you shut up. <laughs> Text me at... Messages me at three. Oh, I slept two hours late. I'll be there at five. It's 
It's usually like four, but whatever. Whatever. <laughs> I don't. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I guess. Uh, why didn't they wait for you? That's kind of messed up that they just left. When using stretch tech, time is important. Everything runs out, runs on a specific schedule. So if you miss it, you miss it. And they're certainly not going to send another one for one person. Damn, that sucks. Wow, didn't you have an alarm clock or someone to wake you? Trust me, it was a series of uh, many unfortunate events that led to that happening. The main one being that even though I woke up with a, enough time to reach the starport, I got lost in Adastra City's terrible public transportation system. I was running from platform to platform, wolves all around me trying to touch me because they've never seen a cat before, and I could barely read the signs because, well, my species, um, water comes from the eyes when we're stressed, so... Oh, they cry. Oh, you were crying? You know what that is? <coughs> yeah, my species does it too. He looks away, and I can see the inside of his ears turn red. Ah, I did not know that. It's a shared trait among us and the wolves, but I don't know many others that can do it, aside from the Chemians. I assume that's how that's pronounced. It's either Chemians or Chemians, but mm -hmm. I guess Chemians would make sense because the, the Mesopotamians, yes. <laughs> Sargon, Hammurabi, Ashurbanipal, <laughs> and, and Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh. Yeah. <laughs> that's for no one. That's, that's, <laughs> that's for, for you and me. <laughs> that's for literally no one. <laughs> I still think about that song sometimes. <laughs> Same. <laughs> anyway, I eventually decide, oh my god, cough drop, don't stab me. <laughs> That's okay. why you crunch it before it gets too sharp. No. Yeah. No, I like to see how sharp it can get, because it's really funny to have it, like, form lopsided. I mean... And see what funny shapes it gets while guess, sitting in one side of the mouth. I guess so. Sure. Okay. <laughs> It just it just tends to also lacerate your tongue and gums. Fuck it. If this is how I go, that's how I go. What a way, huh? <laughs> anyway, I eventually decided to use my situation to continue my work and build a relationship with the Imperial family, so I became Cam uh, Cassie's pet. Alex's situation doesn't sound all that different from mine, even though the reasons for us getting here were very different. When does the uh, next ship come? Alex shrugs. <clears throat> Years. At least one decade, but sometimes more. I am hoping uh, within the next year, few years, though. I'm sorry to hear that. Heh, <laughs> it's not the worst life. And the wolves treat me well enough. We have a special relationship. With Cassius? Between us and the wolves, unlike the other siblings, our parents originated in the same galaxy. Though our views are very different, uh, there's a bond there. Alex, is br uh, bleh. Alex uh, brushes his paws together. Are you done? Yeah. Uh, calm, we're finished. And with that, the uh, uh, plate, plate, plat, platter, plat, plate, or plat, platters, play card. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> play oh sword. Oh my god. <laughs> Isn't that the captain from Star Trek? I'm joking, because his name is Picard. Oh, okay. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> Way to completely not even pick up on my fucking great, amazing, fantastic <laughs> joke. How dare you? Look, I'm not a Star Wars fan. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. No, yeah, you love that Star-Lord guy, right? You know? Um, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. For sure. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> My favorite Star Lord, Kitty Pride. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That's very good. 10 out of 10. Good job. A right? plus. Right. That's for all two comic book readers in the world. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, the um, uh, platters and glasses float away. I'm uh, starting to get used to all this. But, Marco, was it? Yeah. Ha, I'm sorry. I guess we skipped introductions. You already know uh, me as Alexio, but you can call me Alex. 
Uh, hello, Alex. <clears throat> hello, Marco. Now, uh, so now that we're no longer pretending that you're not a sapient anymore, where are you from? Tell me about yourself. <laughs> Tell me your secrets. Tell me your secrets, Marco. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me how to bring you down from the inside. <laughs> That sounded so oddly sexual. I, I didn't know. mean for that to, but you're kind of right. Sorry. Yeah. That, not my intent. Don't get me wrong. Like, like, I, I said, like, bring him down from the inside like he was some kind of business or something. Yeah. Or some, some organization or government, but he's just Marco. Right. You bring him down from the inside by putting a knife in his inside him through his skin. Oh, I was thinking like a dick in the ass. Or or that if you really want, you know. It's the same thing, really. I mean, it can be. We we we've seen that it can murder. <laughs> uh, that gives me a pause. While he's uh, been really nice to me so far, I know I can't just reveal everything to Alex. So I settle on being vague, like he was. Well, I'm from. Far away, but less far away than you. I'm a primate. I see. Are you important among your people? No, I'm just a student. Oh, uh, do you know why Amicus chose you then? He chose me at random. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I, I think he just chose me at random. I just happened to be where he, um, uh, where the uplift occurred. Alex blinked and then laughed. That's just like Amicus. <laughs> yeah, it it is, actually. How do you know? You've only met the guy for like a day. Yeah. <laughs> but I guess it makes sense uh, to choose a commoner if he wants to unite the abandoned children again. Like, imagine if, like, the U.S. president went and got uplifted. Oh, my God. Um... <laughs> it's like, yeah, met, had a romance with Amicus. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty important. I, I like, I, I, I am the head of a governing body of a... Of a country of millions of, of people do you want a furry as the president that'd be kind of funny though like doing speeches in like his fursuit see i don't know about yeah. that <laughs> maybe maybe not his fursuit like maybe not with the head on but if you were like the big paws that'd be hilarious <laughs> no, no, you, you, you don't want like no because just imagine it because you know that like it would be you know first first suit right but it would have like a business suit over it oh, that'd so be kind of be, fun like, actually yeah and and he would be like gray for a grumpy like grandpa dog like <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> what do you think Joe Biden's persona is? Because <laughs> that's who president. That's who's president right now. As, as of the time of this recording, I mean he's there. You know. I don't hear any news about him, so sometimes I just think we're presidentless. It's so weird not to have like headlines about our president every five minutes. It's it's weird getting used to, isn't it? Like it's like wow. That's kind of nice. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of kind of pleasant. But you do forget. You're like, oh, yeah. We got one of those. Yeah. You know, the fact that he's not not in the news can be both good and bad. Like, is he doing anything? <laughs> like, Is he dead? Um, uh, <laughs> you know. You know how he's old. Goes. He's old. Apparently the reason why he speaks the way he does is that he used to stutter. Oh, hmm. Okay. Worked on it. Yeah, because I mean, you know, if you have uh, an impediment, typically you're told to slow down to so that your words can like you yeah. can really think about what you're gonna say. Like okay people. <laughs> yeah, I like, didn't mean to swallow that cough drop while I was drinking water. Now that cough drop's just gone. Oof. <laughs> Was it, it wasn't a whole one though. It was, no, you, no, you've like been working on it one, for a while. But it's just kind of like I wanted that to last a bit. <laughs> Poor shame. Right. Poor right. shame. He didn't answer my question. Though. I'm. I don't. I don't what know. Is, what is persona? Yeah. yeah. Is Megan sloth. said it was a sloth. That could be fun. Oh my god. That'd be pleasant. <laughs> President Joe Biden, the sloth. Or is that too cute? Well, I mean, they can be. I mean, probably some people would describe him as cute. I don't know. They're probably out there. He's not, like, the ugliest president we've ever had. This is facts. That was, like, last year. <laughs> Has it already been a year? Yeah. Oh, fuck. So, like, two years ago. <laughs> mm -hmm. It was, you know, just after pandemic, I think. Right? Something like that. I don't remember when the last election year was. I don't know. It feels like when the pandemic happened, like, 
news stopped. Yeah. That's fair. Probably fair to say. Though, unironically, the best thing that happened with the uh, with the pandemic, mm-hmm. no MCU content. I was so happy. <laughs> like, I didn't have to see headlines about it. No news, no speculation. No one bothering you about it. Facts. It was just nice. Oh, yeah. I decide that uh, shifting the conversation away from me is a good tactic for now. Yeah, uh, didn't he explain that to you? Um, maybe a little. He didn't tell me all that much. <laughs> I don't take it personally. Amicus doesn't often think ahead. <laughs> True. Uh, right now, the wolves are a bit in a, in a bit of a strange situation. Again, uh, this is between you and me, but you've fallen behind the other... Wait, they've fallen behind the other siblings in terms of uh, spread and resources. Uh, the main reason being that uh, they don't uplift their children to similar intelligence levels as themselves. Intelligence levels? I thought they just spread their culture. Alex frowns at that. You don't know? I guess you were uh, abandoned, but you should know that your intelligence... Uh, every uh, child, a child's intelligence was uplifted by a sibling. Oh, uh, no, I guess we lost that bit of information. Well, uh, that's the end of their problems. Uh, these children are um, ind- ind- indentured uh, servants, mm-hmm. in a way, in exchange for having their intelligence mostly uplifted. Uh, they have to serve the Empire until they repay its uh, debt is repaid. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Oh, and how long has uh, that been going on? Yeah, well, uh, let's just say that the first successful uplift, uh, uplifted uh, wolf children, wasn't quite uh, finished. Oh, they haven't quite finished repaying their debt. That's a good movie. Oh yeah, yeah, facts. Uh, that sounds like slavery. <laughs> Alex glances at me. It does, doesn't it? <laughs> that confuses me. <laughs> but if they all, if they have all these uh, robots and stuff, why don't, uh, why do they need sapiens to do to be their slaves? Advanced um ar- artif- artificial mm-hmm. uh, sapiens are gifted by the parents. Uh, we can't uh, build them. We're a bit spoiled here in the palace, but outside not so much. And even then, artificial uh, sapiens isn't um perfect. And uh, likely never will be. Actually, thinking, uh, actual thinking machines don't exist. Uh, this is why uplifting children to the same intelligence level as a sibling is important. A good idea can a good ideas can come from anywhere. I guess your people uh, uh, don't do what the uh, wolves do. No, we uplift our children as much as we can. This practice is isolated to the wolves. They're seen by the other siblings as uh, harsh on their own children. And, um, rights of sapience in general. I see. It's starting to, um, uh, I'm starting to see uh, the wolves and even Amicus in a whole new light. As if uh, reading my mind, Alex, uh, Alex goes on. But uh, things are changing. Amicus uh, choosing you as his pet shows that he sees you as uh, close to an equal. But then there's Cassius. <clears throat> Alex's tail swishes around on the bench between us. Hmm? Uh, he'd rather, uh, he's, he'd rather that things stay the same, or even regress. Uh, that's why he's, um, made a strong challenge against Amicus. There are many wolves who are in, unsure of, of the change Amicus suggests, and the proposed alliances with, between the uh, wolves and the Caminian, Caminians, uh, is only adding to it. So, was the Emperor, like, a shitbag, too? Like, I mean, you know, like, what changes? Like, Amicus wants to really uplift but cassius wants to really regress i wonder what the current or i wonder what the what the just what the previous recent, guy like, yeah. is that from, oh, like was, is he more like cassius or would he be more like was he more like amicus hmm. no idea could be interesting uh cam 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 they're another sibling species the most powerful in the galaxy in fact uh, but that uh, worries a lot of people. There hasn't uh, there hasn't been a uh, war between siblings in over a hundred years, but the last one was between the Chemians and the wolves. 
You can imagine uh, what sort of problems that might create. So Cassius wanted, uh, wanting the wolves to stay independent and in complete control of their children is rather popular. You might wonder why I'm telling you this, but I want you to understand the empire that you're in. If uh, if we'll make it easy, it will make it easier to navigate. Uh, I was in um, in fact wondering why he's telling me all this. Does he have some other motive that he's not telling me? And I look over at him. Do you want Cassius to become emperor? I like that we can discuss a lot of things, and being a sibling. Uh, allows me to have more freedom than most. Uh, but that's one thing that I should uh, probably keep uh, a silent on. You little bitch. He's, he's political. He's a smart little fella. He's a smart lad. Uh, so smart he has a mug around his throat. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> yeah, I just keep Yeah, you just want to lift him. Maybe that's how Cassius uh, smooches him. He like, picks him up, he, like, picks it up with... <laughs> and sets him back on his shoulders. Into that. Huh? Into that. I guess Ooh. people do like head like like people with detachable heads. Like that's like a thing. Oh, I was. Yeah, oh, that's what collars. I. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Darius. Never mind. Over I'm, here. Like, uh, we're moving on. Are we? Horizon of Kings. We're moving on. I don't know. Explain. Explain. I don't have anything to say about it. <laughs> Just, there's there's art that I've seen on Twitter on my dash. It's just kind of how it is. People retweet things. We're moving on. Oh, is what it the is are a you, lot of people? Oh, it's probably on his secret Twitter. Do you have a secret Twitter? No. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Josh. <laughs> No one else has retweeted your tweet yet, Josh. Good. There's no notifications on it, right? No. <laughs> Fucking ridiculous. Oh, fuck. Ian. <laughs> Did he say something about it? <laughs> Ian, before this goes viral. Very good. Thanks, Ian. <laughs> Thanks, Ian. <laughs> Bless it. Oh, that only uh, confuses me more, but it doesn't sound like he's uh, on Cassius's side. Uh, maybe Amicus and I can uh, find an ally in him. Or maybe he's playing, maybe he's a double Or agent. maybe a romantic partner. Well, I think I would prefer Amicus if this whole thing is to uh, treat other sapiens equally. Uh, from what I can tell, and that seems to please Alex. Well, we'll find um, out soon after the trials. Alex's mood suddenly brightens. But anyway, I've um, really been enjoying our time together today. Uh, like I said, it's so nice to be able to talk to someone who isn't my superior. I like to talk to people who are below me. I uh, hope we can do this more <laughs> this uh, often while we're here. Ah. Yeah, yeah. Yes. There you go. Okay. Uh, yeah, of course. Wonderful. Alex raises a paw. Rises, raises, rises, raises, ra 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 raisins rises. a paw uh, to look up at the sun at Vita. Oh. Uh. They just have a Vita circling. <laughs> <laughs> the, the PS Vita is just orbiting this moon. <laughs> Oh my god! When, when and, and every every day it goes by. Every day you see it go by. There's a different game playing on it. I'm like, oh great! It's Senran Kagura Bon Appetit today. Fuck. <laughs> Fucking lit. Let's go. I mean, I'm not the I don't, one that bought that game. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, okay. Any, anyway. Uh, we should keep working. It's starting to get uh, too hot out here. For the next several hours, we work around the garden before finally moving inside to uh, walk around the palace a bit. Okay. So after 10 minutes of reading, we will stop for today. Okay. <laughs> for this part. Yeah, we kind of... Uh, yeah. Fuck, they love it. The <laughs> they facts. love it. You, all, you know what you're here it's for. It's the Adastra podcast. True. Right? Yeah. It's not nearly as... 
we haven't had an episode nearly as bad as some echo parts that's fair there was like oh it was in at the beginning of tj's route uh-huh. near the beginning when we go to the school okay. and we sat there for 20 minutes talking about kingdom hearts <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we haven't had that yet. Yeah, that hasn't happened. It hasn't yet, happened yet. So. Don't bring up King of Hearts. Right, facts. We'll, we'll see, see you around, everyone. Like two hours. No! <laughs>